gamers and geeks. Welcome to an ogre, an old guy's geekly review. And this is for Edge of Eternity. Just came out for uh, Xbox, PlayStation, I believe uh, computer, but I believe it's been on the PC for just a little while, uh, maybe maybe a year or two. And uh, so this review is going to cover whether or not I think you should play this game. And we'll just dive into it. Okay, so this is a... Uh, active time based, so turn based with an active time bar role playing game. And it feels like a Final Fantasy type clone. It feels like a JRPG, but it is not a JRPG. It's actually a Western release from a uh, uh, studio in France. Uh, and I honestly was excited about that because sometimes uh, these second tier JRPGs, I don't really care for them because um, while I might like the combat system and stuff, they don't do enough localization, uh, voiceovers and so forth for me to like them. But the Western releases tend to do that. So I was hoping to get the best of both worlds. What I got instead was kind of a middle of the road of both worlds. The um, Nothing in this is particularly bad, but also nothing in this is particularly great either. It, it feels a little old, the graphics feel a little dated, uh, it feels slow, which is ultimately after about uh, nine hours of play, that's kind of why I stopped, is it, it felt slow and uh, just wasn't moving along. There wasn't enough to keep me interested. That's not to say that it has, uh, you know, bad qualities to it because it, it ran well, has a, a nice combat system, a nice turn-based system, different things you can do. And the dialogue itself, even though it's only partially voiced, I found rather uh, witty, different, um, not your run of the mill kind of exchanges between characters. And that was really nice. So should you play this? There's a lot of games out there. And if you have played most of the high rank, you know, top shelf role playing games, then this is something you might want to look into if you're really itching for another role playing game. Another game that came out this weekend, which is also a role playing game, which I would probably suggest over this one, uh, which is Lost Ark, and it is an MMO, uh, but the presentation seems a little more snappy than, uh, than this one, so take that for what it is. This has been an Ogre, an Old Guy's Geekly Review, and I hope this has helped you make a decision on Edge of Eternity. As always, have a nice day.